from a simple pencil to a luxurious car, all design evokes emotions. And these emotions, they are crucial for our design discipline because if it doesn't feel good, people won't buy it. And if they own it, they won't use it. At the same time, however, they are also challenging because they are subjective. So different people will have different emotions. But there are also principles, universal principles of emotions. In this masterclass, we will look at those universal principles and see how you can apply them in design. So what emotions can design evoke? How can we measure these emotions? How can we use that in a design process? In addition, we will also look at the more long-term effective impact of design on people. So then we're talking about design for subjective well-being. We believe that design can actually contribute to sustainable happiness of people. And we will show you how you can do that as a designer. So if you're inspired by the topic of design, emotion and happiness, I hope to see you at the masterclass Design for Emotion.